In IBD, the treat to target concept is new and relates to using objective patient outcomes to confirm the benefit or not of specific IBD therapies. The precise targets are yet to be confirmed in randomized controlled trials. However, potential targets will include one or more of mucosal healing, biomarker normalization, improvement in diagnostic CT or MRI imaging, stable drug levels without associated antibodies, and histological healing. These targets are in contrast to the simple clinical assessment of response that has been used for many years. Recently, the REACT study demonstrated the benefit of treat to target. The REACT study compared clinical care pathways with specific targets and early combined biologic therapy versus conventional clinical assessment and therapy without specific targets. While REACT found similar clinical remission rates in both groups, the patients in the treat to target and defined clinical pathways group had fewer surgeries and fewer hospitalizations. The STRIDE program recently published consensus and evidence-based recommendations for treatment targets in both ulcerative colitis and Crohn's disease. These recommendations have provided the first steps to implementing a treat-to-target strategy in inflammatory bowel disease. Stride identified that the best objective treatment targets for patients with IBD were patient-related symptoms plus endoscopic mucosal healing or resolution of inflammation on CT or MRI cross-sectional imaging. 